Hi everybody and welcome to the first ever episode of Monday ke Pande Stories brought to you by your uncle Sahil Shah. Shall we begin? Once upon a time there lived a boy called Arsh. Arsh was so badly behaved all his friends called him an Arsh hole. Arsh's girlfriend worked in the news media. She was in charge of making a list of all the girls called Jharna living in her area. Yes, she was a Jharna list working on a Jharna list. <laughs> Together, she worked with the editor Karan, who was in charge of the Karan affairs, and Arjun, who was in charge of telling them what month it was. Every time they'd walk up to him, they'd be like, "Hey, buddy, what month is it?" And he'd be like. Uh, June, and he would be right one in about every twelve months. They were sitting in the office one day, figuring out what story should they cover next. And there were a ton of stories around the world, like for example, the case of this girl called Bhumika who died and now only haunts Mika Singh. Yeah, she always goes boo, Mika. Or, <laughs> or the case of Sean Connery. Who keeps on calling an Indian man called Vishwesh and asking him for directions? He always calls him and he's like, "Hey, Vishwesh, do we have to go?" <laughs> uh, Vish Vishwesh. That is a joke only my friend Anish will appreciate because it is a niche joke. They were sitting there perplexed, thinking, "Hmm, this is it. This is the end of the newspaper. I don't think they will ever have any story to cover." When the intern Ishika came running in with a piece of paper in her hand, and she like, "Boss." Ishika kya kare? <laughs> and they read the news and it was startling. It was the best coronavirus survival story they had ever read. There was a girl called Kriti and her elder brother Manoj had sneezed on her. Manoj had walked up to her and said, "Excuse me, Manoj is leaking." Hachu! And poor Kriti, she fell sick. She went to the hospital. She was in coma and she was critical her doctor was a doctor called dr vivek who said don't worry one day we wake her up and he tried all methods and he even one day said don't worry we shall shake her because she was a fan of bluff master and he was a fan of shaking people and guess what everything worked out and kriti came out of coma she is now a full stop <laughs> Anyways, this was a fantastic news story that was published. Everyone was happy. The newspaper became super, super, super successful, and together everyone realized that they need to move into a bigger house. So they moved into their friend Aftab's house, and all of them lived happily ever Aftab, except Arsh. He still was an Arshol. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was edited by my friend Vidhi, so I hope you enjoyed this video, and. Uh, If you did then please leave a comment below and let me know which story I shall read next week till next week stay safe wash your hands and be careful of bhumika bye